But I ain't gonna lie, rapping sometimes that shit ain't for everybody, bro. That, that uh, too, look, bro. all right, man. Yeah, that shit. Think they can rap, everybody bro. wants that shit to be a rapper, everybody, bro. bro. Everybody want to be some type of uh, creator nowadays. Everybody wants to be uh, notorious, bro. Everybody right. feels like they have a story to give. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Ain't nothing wrong with that necessarily, bro. But you know, some people need to get a job, as they say. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. <laughs> I mean, I ain't gonna ain't lie. That nigga Charlamagne, if you talk about that shit, be like, nigga, fuck you. But right. uh, you kind of have a point, like. Nah, I mean, you know what, bro? Hey, Ross said it took 10 years, bro. Yeah, he was CEO and all that. You know what I mean? So, I mean, you got to believe in yourself, but at the same time, you got to keep it real with yourself, too, though. Yeah. Because, you know, if it ain't working, it really ain't working, bro. Shit. You know what I mean? But if you got, you know, some type of traction or whatever, you know what I mean? You just got to keep going because keep consistency going. is the key. So, yeah. it's going to work out eventually, bro. bro you know I don't I mean? at this point, eventually I don't seen a lot out. of niggas, bro. Bro, I um I got a friend, man, my 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 milf, you feel me? She <laughs> my my cougar, she 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 knows a nigga named Moonwalker. And he came out with that song Lizzo. <laughs> No. Bro, I'm trying to tell you that song go hard though. Yeah. It's a TikTok crazy banger, bro. Mm-hmm. You feel me? The nigga, I think he's from Miami too. You feel oh, me? For real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe we could bring him on a podcast hopefully one of these days. Yeah. But like, yeah, Moonwalker, bro. Like that nigga been making music forever, nigga. Right. Forever. And he just got his big break. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit going crazy. He out here performing this shit. It's a lot of people like that. Patience, you feel me? It's definitely consistency. But yeah. I mean, Ah, you know, if you get a job, bro, ain't nothing wrong with that ain't job, bro. That, I yo, mean, ain't oh, nothing wrong with getting the I job, I got a question bro. for you, for homie. Real. Have you ever been fired? I have. <laughs> <laughs> How the fuck? They, you so professional, bro. How, I do. What the fuck happened for them to fire you, kid? Like, bro. what? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. That shit. Dog, I, I, it was on me. I, 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 I'm going to say that. It well, was you on pull me. a buzz? Yeah, I did do some buzzed ass shit. I did. It wasn't no crazy ass shit, but it, uh, it, it, what it you was buzzed. Bruh. <laughs> My dumb ass. <laughs> so I sent this email out, bro, like a mass email, bro. It yeah. was like to reschedule a meeting. And my dumb ass, um, I fucking sent that shit out with the wrong date on there, bro. Like on some, like, Yo, I was already doing like five different things. Oh, My manager walks yeah. in. He's like, "Yo, um, send an email out now to." Um, Damn, but they fired you for that, bro. Thought I was just hating on me, bro. From the jump, like, bro. but that was like, it gave him the fuel to like. You know, look for a reason because oh. he got chewed out because of that. Because of that, oh, yeah. Okay, so he okay. got chewed out. So then after that, he was just, like, looking for a reason, bro. And one day, uh, I had called out sick or whatever. Mm-hmm. Came back. Them boys gave me the boot. KFC. KFC, my shit. Wow. Hey, you know what's so yeah. funny? I think KFC is only between, like, our friend group. Like. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> KFC know, mean to, like, you know ignore somebody. Kev, like, man. Shout out to that boy Kev. Yo. Man. That nigga did um, show me that word. Yeah, I Kev. Yeah. He, I think he's the originator of that You're shit. Right. Because there's a story behind that. Mm-hmm, yeah, you feel story. me? We got we to gotta get, <laughs> mm-hmm, gotta get yeah, KFC, there. bro. They KFC, they you kid. KFC Kev. me, bro. Wow. That shit was... Nah, that shit was a fucking... That should have do something to you mentally, dog. Yeah, bro. I ain't gonna bro. hold you, bro. If you ain't really like there mentally, bro, like yo, you don't suck. cave in, bro. I man, like, look, that should make you feel. Bro, different, I almost bro. fucking like you. <laughs> I've been fired and I've walked out of a job. You feel <laughs> me? So the first time, um, I, I got fired. The first time, yo, and this is the first time in my life, bro. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. First, first time, time, bro. Nah, like every other job that I had, like I've been, I've only had like two, three jobs. I was I worked at Dave and Buster's. I was a teacher. I think that was it. Did I work? Oh, I worked at a call center. That's where I got fired. There we oh, go. For real? That's where I got fired. You see, I had to remember that shit. Mm-hmm. All right, so this is what happened. Fuck this place. So long story short, oh, I'm at this call fine. center in Tallahassee, right? And um, I'm in college. Well, I had just graduated college or whatever. Mm-hmm. And um, it was a cool little spot. So what I used to do, I used to do Uber and shit too. Uber had just started. I was one of the first Uber drivers on this shit. Mm-hmm. So I'll do the call center in the morning, finish at like two, three o'clock, and do Uber at night. You feel right. me? So now, the call center. Um, I also was working at a, a school too. I was an assistant band director, so I was doing a couple things. Mm-hmm. But at this specific spot, bro, 
they would make me basically like call people and it was like a loan place to where like every like they would get like people would put in like their information if they was trying to get money and right. then you call them and be like yo we, we we know some people that could get you some bread you feel mm. me so if everybody every person that would get a loan like they'll get the shit you feel me okay so now i'll get a little co- commission mm-hmm. so now it went from being like nine dollars an hour I'm making like damn near twenty in this shit, right. bro. Because With I'm eating off of these right. commissions, bro. Mm-hmm. Like I'm going crazy right. on these niggas, Seven bro. Shit. I'm going crazy. Mm-hmm. But like, and it was like a little um a little TV that said leads, right? So that shit that shit say like a thousand leads, nigga. I'm probably running through like two hundred. Like, just yo, if you call them, call them niggas, call them, call them, call them. And they used to be mad. They used to be like, yo, you moving too fast. I'm like, what you talking about, like? The nigga not interested, bro. Right. Like, you want me to sit here and just stay on the phone with a motherfucker that's going to hang up on me anyway? Right. I'm like, <laughs> the fuck? Facts. So, <laughs> yeah, so, for real. You put it like that for real, dog. You feel me? Right, so, right. Um, and I, so, like I said, I'm closing on some of these people. You feel right. me? I put them out. Um, you know, my code switch starts. Out, hey, how's it going, sir? Mm-hmm. Um, uh, would you like to get a loan today? I seen that you uh, uh your credit score is at six thirty, and uh, you know what I'm saying. Like, right. I just start going, saucing them blunts, kid. Um, it is usually old people though. Mm-hmm. Hello, <laughs> like, you know. What right. and, bro, and, people always be plotting on old people. Now that's right. fucked you up, so- bro. bro. You could sauce no, an like old person. Best up, bro. Like, I don't know nothing about yamming, but you could sauce an old person. Boy. Dad, that's so messed look, up, bro. Yeah, man. Long story. <laughs> <laughs> so long so story short, man. I'm saucing all these old people getting this fee, bro. I'm getting to the bread, man. My check's looking nice. Mm-hmm. You feel me, bro? At the same time, I don't know if you remember, but I be I I, be, I draw. You feel me? Right. So I'm drawing at the same time. I'm doing all this shit. They had a little of uh, of uh, what's that shit called? Uh, a uh, uh, shit. The shit that uh uh like uh uh uh. uh yeah. To do what? When you when you when you say it like uh, a prompt, there we go. They mm-hmm. had a prompt, so they had a prompt, bro. A script. script. There we go. They had a script. I memorized a script, and I'm just drawing at work. So I'm drawing at work, calling 200 people a day, getting to the feet. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Them them crackers is, is they don't know how I'm doing this shit. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> they don't know how I'm doing this shit. I'm going crazy. Boys, like hold so, on, dog. This, this nigga, nigga this, this nigga, nigga ain't gotta Cameron, be doing bro. fraud. Bro, this Fraud. is Cameron, bro. He come up to me. He was like the the uh the son of the owner of the company, mm-hmm. bro. You feel me? So he was like not the CEO, but he was whatever was under that. Right. Just like, yo, you got to stop drawing, bro. You got to like slow down and stop drawing. So I'm like, all right, wait. <laughs> what Only you draw during your break. <laughs> Only draw during your break. So every time, so it be my break, I'm starting to draw. I ain't, ain't shit to do out here, so I'm just drawing. Right. You feel me? I start to draw, just see me drawing <laughs> again. He called me in the office, right? I'm like, bro, it's my break, kid. No, nah, man, you was drawing on your ship. <laughs> yo. Then I'm like, yo, man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I think you picking on me. Yo, this cracker stood up on some slave master. Oh, like, I'm like, bro, yeah. what the fuck, bro? You got me fucked, fucked up. up you got way. me fucked up, nigga. All the way. You feel me? So <laughs> like, I'm down there. I'm. I was about to match his energy, about to start ripping the like computers and shit from the shit. But I was mm-hmm. like, you know what? Let me just vibe. You feel me? Yeah. So that nigga was like, you know what? Ah, uh, ah, uh, you're fired. So I'm looking at him. I was like, all right. I walked out the office. Just I like probably like that. slapped some shit down on the floor, and I went to the motherfucking um P uh what was HR. Yeah. Paw my eyes up. Fuck no, I got no fucking money no more. God uh, damn. Uh, oh, I'm going to do, bro. Like right. I'm going crazy, like. Yeah, bro. And what they said? Oh man, the PR lady, the white lady, she's looking at me like, they don't give a fuck. She ain't give, yeah. she ain't give a shit. No. Ain't give a shit, bro. No. HR, she ain't give a shit. Of course not. <laughs> what? Yeah, bro, that shit was wild, bro. Like that shit was a crazy. Ass yeah, bro. Man. And then you know what's crazy? He DM me. No, he even DM me. He went on my SoundCloud and commented on my SoundCloud and said, "I'm sorry for like being an asshole." Uh your music is actually good. I hope. Man, the best. you could have that I hope shit, nigga. Fuck you, say, nigga. Man, you could have that shit, homie. Kiss what? my ass, man. Get the fuck out of here. Kiss my man. ass. Yo, ZB. If y'all boys want more content like this, man, make sure y'all boys subscribe to the YouTube channel at Florida Music Only. Make sure y'all boys follow us on Instagram at Florida Music Only and Miami Boys Podcast and the TikTok at Miami Boys Podcast. Yo.